What is going on, everybody? We're back on it. One Piece 425. Have the whole, you know, jailbreak sequence going here. Giggle game, Scooby-Doo, Chase, you know, all those type of things. As Boa is getting closer to going to see Ace, so I'm, I'm curious of like what that interaction is going to be because it's, it looks like she's going to get there before us. Um, Garp is currently there, to my knowledge. So what happens if she gets there and Luffy comes like crashing down through the roof and like alarm sound and it sounds like it sounds like an absolute man. honestly I wouldn't be surprised if uh, we somehow end up fuck around and get captured like Boa doesn't get in trouble but we, like us like Luffy ends up getting captured I don't know it seems like a mess but honestly they're not showing me anybody that's worth a damn like I said, I still think there's the we still have the warden to see, but as far as like I don't know who else they have here, and I always find this interesting. And I went on a rant about this a couple reactions ago of like, you see this in stories and stuff all the time of like that's that's the scariest prison and no one's ever broken out of there. They keep the worst of the worst there and yada yada yada, but like, <clears throat> there's never anybody capable of keeping the worst of the worst in check if something. Like, you always have to have, like, the worst case scenario. If they break out or someone comes to break them out or maybe somebody's corrupt inside your own, you know, camp and they, you know, are part of the breakout. But, like, it's the same thing with, like, My Hero. Like, when you lock up uh, All for One, um, you better have people on hand that can, like, strap this man down if he ever was to break free, you know? Um, <clears throat> in a Naruto situation, like, if Madara was to get captured or like, you know, some of the strong Akatsuki members were to be locked up in a prison cell or something like that, you better have equal or stronger ninja that are there 24 seven, you know, it's all like Aaron being locked up or locked up. It's like, you guys can't actually hold me here. If I wanted to flex out and bust out of here, I could. now this is different because you've got the sea prism and those type of things. And, but it's the same concept. Like if the worst case scenario happens, I'm sure there's procedures and plans in place, but let's be serious though. Um, if the worst case scenario was to happen, what's your what what's the prison's play here? Um, maybe we're going to be finding out shortly. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. <clears throat> Turn on some heat. It's a little chilly. And you guys gave me a good breakdown of his abilities and like the feet and the purpose of all those type of stuff. So I do see your comments, even if I haven't gotten to all of them. It's been a crazy busy week. Like it's three o'clock in the morning right now is when I'm recording this so that you guys can have it in about eight hours. So I'm just trying to make sure we're ready to go. And this thing that he's been looking for. His body better keep up. I was about to say. What the hell? They've got all the beasts down on this level. I actually want to pull up the comments that you guys left because I didn't make sure I have all of it in case I bring it up again. Pulling up the Patreon on the phone real quick. We just break through that wall or... It's not like they couldn't. Where is it? Here we go. Wild Beast Hell. Bro, Beast, Beast ain't shit. I've yet to see a sea beast or anybody cause any trouble. But it's so interesting because like they always get smacked. They always talk about like the sea kings and the sea beasts and all those type of things. But they uh, they've yet to like actually fuck shit up. But Shanks did lose his arm to one, which is interesting that he couldn't protect Luffy and like handle the beast at the same time. Eh? Nani? Why did they just give him that flying animation sound? Just punch it. Punch it in the face. Get rid of it.
Oh god. Eh? Yeah, just fuck him up on the inside. Why are they giving it those crazy sound effects? It's insane. Did he do something? Kinda. Alright guys, let's keep moving. Either like kick it in the face again or keep mo Oh shit, they know what level, they know where we're at. They said they can't see Luffy's face still. This is pretty serious. Like what? what? We gotta go down, guys. We gotta go down. This is gonna be a Scooby Doo episode, isn't it? Just them running from a bunch of different wild beasts and shit. Oh, what was that Scyther shit? He has a, like a security hat on and shit. Good lord. Um, let's just punch him in the face. We don't have time for this. Luffy, stop admiring. Like, your, your little note card over there that has a corner left is like burning out. We don't have time to like admire things. Like, just punch him in the face. Hakai him. And let's keep it moving. Kick him? Oh. That's awkward. <laughs> like, this is what they're burning my episode screen time with. Guys, we're in a hurry! We're in a hurry! What is this Pidgeotto attack shit we got going here? Eh? Uh, what? It's a big ass bird. Just replace Buggy with Usopp. Usopp, sir. They know who it is. But do they know that there's relation between Luffy and Ace? Is it that easy to figure out? Is that just a wild chicken? Eh? It's going to be one of these episodes. Let me lower my expectations. We're not going to get any crazy plot build are we probably not it's just gonna be this the whole time i'm assuming i was about to say like luffy we don't have time this is a very serious serious matter we're dealing with here very serious like ace is gonna die oh yeah buggy hasn't seen this Capture them, surely. Yeah, we'll be able to do that. Right through the door. Yep. One of those snails is dead. R.I.P. to the snail. <clears throat> Maybe we can get some good story from this here. If they get all the way down there. Who is the warden? Maybe the warden's like serious, you know? Why did you have to make that his personality? 
that he has bad digestive problems and has to sit on the toilet all day. That, like, what? Venom, venom fruit. Does he, re does he emit poison? F like, does he have control of it? Or he walks around leaking poison not even purposefully because you can't even hang around him if that's the case, if he can't control it. Like, if it just leaks out of him like an odor. Maybe he's got some skill. <laughs> I don't know. Pretty bad case of the runs. My man's got the bubble guts, he says, just going right down his leg. He eats poisons. True. Hurry and get us to Ace, please. Who's been... Uh-oh. Is it that serious? Interesting. Maybe he's about that life. Have we seen a Marine yet that has status? Oh no, they're going to get the call. Oh no. About Luffy. Um, have we seen a Marine yet that has like a, that has like, that's like serious, that has social cues and is a normal person? Honestly? Um, what's his name was? I'll give, I'll give them, the CP9 member, what was his name? Luchi. Luchi's been the only, like, villain, or not even villain, but on the other side... that his personality like like he's like it's it all it's all him it's all him ooh it's boa's twin sister um so i'll, I'll give luchi that for sure it matched the tone i've yet to see so i'm very curious like as we go further because <clears throat> like kazaru what the hell kuma kinda but kuma was so more like did, didn't say shit so it made him mysterious I'd say even Okaji to a little bit too, but Okaji has his, you know. Hmm. So there, there's some. Y'all better hurry up. Y'all better hurry up. It's clearly not working. You need to get down there. Uh, we got done and dusted is what happened. We got dead snails and shit. Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 <clears throat> I was saying, wait, did he shrink? Still gotta fix that problem. Gotta fix that problem or just stop using it altogether. Find a gear four that's like a mix of gear three without the side effects. He beat the fried chicken? Uh, guys? It's not like you guys can get out. Honestly, they need to let the people out. They need the more commotion. 
the better. Buggy, come on, put two and two together, man. The more commotion and people... Mr. Thury. Let them out. It'll help. It'll help, it'll help, it'll help, it'll help. The more people running around, the more chaos, the more like, oh, there's reported escapees over here. And on this level, that level, that level, this level. Um, Just as much commotion as you can cause. Hurry up. We don't need to be here all day. There you go. Good, 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 good. It's the only good thing he's done. Now what? Let's move. Let's start scattering, getting bodies around. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. All right, now help me get out of here. Help me get out of here. Bingo. All right. He's thinking. Somebody's thinking here. Luffy, you guys are taking this shit serious, man. Like, look, come on. Should we just start punching down? Should we try that? Start punching, punching floors down below us and... Oh, yeah, but you guys aren't strong enough to actually deal with anything on this level, though, are you? Maybe Mr. Three is. Guys? Are they going to run rampant, or did they all just get wiped out? There's beast coming, guys. We gotta move. Gotta move, gotta move, gotta move, gotta move. They just went back in their cells. Mm. So maybe we'll go deal with that? We know who this is. We know who this is. I'm, this is. I totally forgot. Crocodile somewhere in here. I can't wait to see Crocodile. It's one of my favorites so far up to this point in the series. I don't need the flashback, guys. So we got to talk about the girl that paints. What's that about? Never got confirmation on that. Don't you dare burn the rest of my episode with this. Episode's over, guys. Pack it up. Pack it up. Pack it up. <laughs> Episode's over. Oh? This is gonna save the entire episode right here? Yes it is, yes it is. This little 10 seconds, this 10 second clip.
They don't know the connection. They don't know the connection. Interesting. Yeah, they're tired of Luffy running around causing chaos. We gotta fuck him up. Serious problems going on right now. It's a prison that has held hundreds of thousands of prisoners. Well, the prison looks like shit. It seems like shit. We got a daycare going on over there. Secret side note, the kid is going to walk out alive. Yeah. There's been one person that's broken out. Is this person still alive and still out there in the world? The Golden Lion? Is he still a thing? There's no way we name drop him and then don't... What the? There's no way we name drop him and don't... um. Uh, follow up on his story, right? <laughs> but we'll go ahead and leave the episode there. Again, nothing crazy. It was your typical... Every time they've they've had anything with beast or animals or anything going on, it's never actually been a thing in One Piece. It's always just like usually a means for them to like kind of do the Scooby Doo shit, where like Nami can run around screaming at the top of her lungs, Chopper can run around screaming at the top of his lungs, Usopp runs around screaming, Luffy's like punching animals in the face, but like bungee gumming over here, over there, you know, all that type of shit. It's it's nothing really serious. They're kind of just like fluff episodes to me. Same thing with this. This. You could have taken out this entire episode, and like it does nothing to the story. There was no like cool moments from it, you know, nothing crazy. Besides, I guess getting introduced to the warden, who again has the like typical personality that we've seen when we kind of run into people. Like I was trying to say, you know, we rarely run into anybody that has like that kind of like seriousness to them. A little bit though, sometimes. Um, I'm assuming he's got some skill. I get the poison part, but again. Is he one of those that's like so reliant on his devil's fruit that like once you get past the poison, like he doesn't possess hockey, he doesn't, you know, I don't know if we'll even get to the point to see him fighting like that in action. Um, but Relay has gotten the only positive thing to come out of this episode, or I guess story point, has been relayed, telephoned to Navy headquarters that, hey, Straw Hat Luffy has broken in to the prison, but they don't know that Luffy and... I'm curious. Do they know? Do the Do they know the Garp and Ace connection? Do they know the Garp and Luffy? Luffy Ace. I'm gonna assume no. They don't know anything about that, um, because they said they don't know why. And then the name drop there of the only prisoner that has, or the only person that has ever escaped. Um, so we'll see. We'll go ahead and leave it there. Nothing too crazy. Um, hopefully the next episodes will be a little bit better, but we'll see. Appreciate it, everybody. Like, share, and subscribe, and as always.